one. Hey, you folks, Quilly Dean here, and welcome to another episode of the Sunni Strike Back with Majin and Shenner. Say hi, guys. Hello. What's up? So, Mad, you reminded me that initially our win condition is not necessarily to literally convert everything, but to have Sunni control over all of Europe. Correct. Yes. So, our win condition is basically at this point get London, get, get Paris. Get France. Done. We win. That's yes. not bad. And I'm going to declare on France right now. Hey, yeah, we were talking about that. Like, they're in the coalition against me, both of them. So, it's better if you or Quill do the uh, declarations. Not a problem. I'm going to go take care of those silly Hainetan rebels for you. Ready? Go for it. Ready, ready. Can we finish this today? Oh, I yeah, hope I so. so. Um, yeah, just check. I can't I can't move my uh, capital if there are rebels at all. Really? Yeah. I mean, I can see that there might be an abuse there, but it is... Like, if there's anything that would cause a nation to move their capital, it might be a mass rebellion. Mm. Can you move it when you're at war? I don't think so. Which is, again, no, it's like, No, that would listen, be cheapy. Well, yeah, it's like, yeah. Hey, look, I just finished a colony out in the middle of nowhere. I'm going to move my capital. God, no one's ever it. done that, <clears throat> Portugal. Yep. I mean, in real life. Yeah. Listen, Europe sucks right now. We're going to There's Brazil. no Portugal in real life. Don't be silly. Mm hmm That's true. So now I just have to wait for some sieges to end. There are some uh, rebels in uh, Northumberland. Rebel scum! I don't have quite enough people to send over there right now. Well, not actually true. Northumberland? Mm-hmm. <gasps> oh, you declared Yay! war on those guys separately? You know you black flagged, right? I forgot about that. <laughs> I'll like, take care uh, of that. That looks great. Um... <laughs> I really don't like that mechanic. Yep. Well, we are no longer allied, so this is true. Yeah. But that doesn't affect the black flag. Apparently, it does. Well, it's not supposed to, anyways. If you're allied in, in in allied provinces, it's supposed to not affect it. But oh, is that true? But it does. Yeah. But it does. So they consider that a bug. Amusingly. So, it might get fixed next patch, or it may never ever get fixed. Probably never <laughs> ever. <laughs> Priorities and things. Oh, don't roll zeros. How do they work? I can't right. believe Trinidad is going to cost me 245 points to the core. That's really? bullshit. Really? Why? I don't know. Well, it's seven tax base, I guess. France. And it was French. So Yeah, so it's got that bullshit. But yep. it's in the new world. That, did, that should be totally cheap. I know. Totally I was cheap. really surprised. Yeah, and you know those coring? Yeah, they aren't coring anymore. I don't know what they're doing this? with their admin power. No, it wasn't even. Oh, 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 your um, your cafe like, ottoman. Yeah. Cafe so ottoman. I, decide, I decided that I don't care. We're gonna. I'm coring the Guiana stuff. Hey. Yay. Percent overextended. <gasps> Not Zapotec. You have Actually, entered into everything... a coalition against me. Oh, fucking Zapotec. God damn it. <laughs> but I finished all my European cores. It's only the islands that are still working on it. Quill, calm down, Quill. I hate them. I'm going to have to play a game as, uh, I don't know. The don't Aztecs? Know just to eat them? Maybe. Or I was going to say, it could play as the Zapotec. Clearly, they're super mighty. Hmm. They are super mighty. Mighty, mighty. Yeah, I'm down just getting there. my manpower back now. There. That remember. overextension kind of ate it. Mm-hmm. So I'm just oh. going to sell uh, London and Paris to the Ottomans so you can core that shit. <laughs> um, time to take over Zealand. Zealand? Boop. Yeah. The Ottomans have changed their capital. Oh, okay. I'm like, what? Oh. <laughs> well, I have all this trade power in Antwerp. Yeah. And I was pirating... In right, Antwerp. so you may as well move your trade there. Did you move your yep. capital or just your trade node? Both. Tra uh, capital. We have taken it over. So if you move the capital, it's 200 admin. And it takes your trade capital if you haven't sw uh, separated them. Okay. Um, but if you move your trade capital, well, your capital capital stays where it was. But 
Yeah, Wait, really? Only still ha I still have two only two merchants. But anyways, I have ninety percent of the trade power in. Uh... Yeah, you're gonna make bank off of that. Uh, it's worth sixty one. It's a pretty potent trade node. Uh, I probably don't need to have this fleet in Constantinople anymore. Goodbye, Patty. Uh, I left you everything in Genoa, didn't I? Get me baguette? Yes, baguette get. With trade power in Genoa? Whoa, Castile no, will now be ruled by the king of Portugal. Personal wow. union. Whoa, Portugal win! It's a good thing that didn't happen at the start of the game. France declared war on Portugal. Succession war causes, Billy. Um, <laughs> that's awesome. All right, you you boys have fun now. They're like we're still relevant, really. We're relevant. We want a succession war. Cosmo Patriots. I don't think so. Light on the infantry there. Speaking of going to no kill both of those. Rival. Oh, back to just the Ottomans now. No. So it's no longer a valid rival, but it's still going to oh, let shit. me Rebels confirm Castile as a rival. Notice. Hmm. Damn, Maybe, that's useful. Like, there. Oh, because... Wait. No, I'm really I just confused. have you two. <sighs> Fuck. My, my options are... I currently have Moogles. But... I had that once, but... Yeah, otherwise... Otherwise, it's just you two. Apparently, everybody else is too tiny. There goes all that religious no, conversion This whole Castilian progress. thing is very confusing. It keeps Actually, telling whole... me that it is, and then it isn't a potential rival. Must be something with the personal unions. Mm. Yeah, yeah, because uh, if you, I found that out in one of my games. Um, they can be considered a rival, but if they're under a personal union, they're considered not to be. Great. Or at least it'll let you time? set them as a maybe. rival and then instantly kill it because they're under maybe, a personal Maybe, maybe. Nope. Fuck. Yeah, that's really annoying. I wonder if a reload would uh, resolve that. Not that, you know, there's any reason to do that right now. Mm, possible. Could just be a game Bastards state issue. Get out of here. It's my sweet yo. My sweet So the question yo. at this point becomes, is there any need for me to declare war on Great Britain or France anymore? Are you guys going to finish them off? Do you need me to right. go after the islands? You might be able to. What's do the story? Something. Tell me what's happening. Good I was, question. I was going to annex both of them. Can you? Probably. Because that's the only question. Think you'll get enough war score? I have 17 war score on France. I don't know how much it's going to cost for their capital, but I do have the ticking war score going, so I'm just going to wait be for like it. Probably like 85 or something. That's what it was when I was trying to get it. Yeah, and neither of them moved it, so. So maybe. Uh, you might want to join the war quill and take a shot at all of uh, France's islands that are left. Okay. Uh oh, quill, you got some rebels in Trinidad Tobago, man. Yeah, I might just oh. let it go. What do we want? Oh, uh, you one? didn't. You didn't sell land. Oh, you couldn't sell land. That's right. Yeah, I couldn't. They weren't doing it. Um, what do we want to call this one? Oh, you got another thing. Okay, Turkish almost Gera. there. Oh, yeah. Little nothing. Because that's basically what they are. Little nothing. Yeah, Guyana, for whatever reason, the, the provinces are it's, so worthless. And it's just so tiny. Like, for a colonial nation? Yeah. They're, I mean, yes, so realistically, there is... Pretty much all of those are individual countries. Stuff like that, but now anyways um but you know for a colonial nation in this game not so they useful they don't have a whole lot going on yeah oh my god they have a five five general they're, they're so Fuck. tiny and they just die and i don't think uh cafe ottoman is coring anything the jerks may not have points they're getting points somehow. The governor's a two-two-two, so I mean, realistically, they should be able to core. I can't get up there while unless the they're saving for making ideas and not coring. That's a that's problem. Smart SMRT. Rebels are these? 
Oh, Patriots. Although okay. we almost buy off Patriots. Patriots. It's fine. Oh, come on. I needed to go negative stability just because. Almost. How about this? Screw you. Because huh? I'm now up to plus three stability. And even though it's their capital, it doesn't cost us any diplo. None. Because we have a claim on it. Very useful. Let's see if this is enough to get peace. Come on, end of the month. End of the month. End of the month. Tick over, please. My god, I have a lot of rebels in Trinidad. Mm -hmm. Ah, just yeah, accept their demands. No big deal. Ten prestige. Nothing. And it lowers the revolt risk by ten. Mm-hmm. Now, hopefully it'll do all the same, and it should. I'll just have to wait until I finish actually sieging it. Meanwhile, my fleet is going to move to... Oh, wow. France is eating Portuguese Australia. Ah, we lost a ton of progress. Why? I don't oh, know. We were at 119, now we're at 100. I'm going to end up taking a bunch of loans at the Damn end of the it. game here. Mm. But I finally okay. paid all mine off. Well, I haven't had any in ages and ages and ages. Got a little bit of inflation, but that's all. And that was, I think, mostly from taking gold and peace deals. I think I was at two inflation, and then I just took a bunch somewhere. of gold. Okay, better. I am finally at the Eastern New Model Infantry. Tech 30? Yep. Good times. Congrats. Actually, I can get Tech 30 in, like, a heartbeat. Literally next month. Did you declare war on Castile? No. <laughs> yes, you did. Did not. You know what you're talking about. I declared war on Castilian or Brazilian Portugal. Or sorry, <laughs> Brazilian Portugal. Hmm. Portuguese Brazil. Because they have stuff I want. Stuff and things. Hmm. Cafe Ottoman so is improving relations with us. Okay. It just so happens that the Portuguese are in a personal union over Castilians. So yep. I can get a little closer. Do a little dance. On their head. Alright. So, the how's time. that... Uh, How's that worst we're doing? Uh, I almost have enough to get London, but I'm nowhere near on uh, Paris. So it's just yeah. going to be a waiting game. I have taking war score. I mean, it's going to happen. I'm going to declare war in Australia soon. Okay. Well, but... I hear there's a bunch of spiders and snakes there. I'm not sure. <laughs> Sounds uh, scary. My treasury income? 311. Wow. From after moving my capital. Because I'm making 193 from trade. That's a lot. Yeah. I don't suppose you want to take care of my bourbon patriots. Uh, Ottomans. Trying to take care of a variety of things, but yes. You got an army right there. Yep. Oh god, no, my upstairs neighbor with the shower again. Damn them. Come Let's on, see if we can make Britain. Cafe Ottoman powerful. I will give them two grand, and I give them like 150,000 worth of... Uh, oh, one point off. We're one point off. 106 out of 107. Um, All right. 150 ducats a month. Feed me, Seymour. Feed me. Make Ooh. a monster. Little Nuttin's helping. They have, they have a whole two troops. They're going to help. Order is restored, plus one stability. Now here's a fun thing. I can declare war... Oh, you got to uh, Great London. Britain. London has fallen. Bam. Bam. And they Go left the coalition three. against me for some reason. Goodbye, Britain. I'm sorry, what? I can't hear you over the coring of London. Oh, that is a beautiful thing. I mean, our borders are crazy. Yep. 
But there is no English left. So oh, how's that fuck these doing? rebels, man? Oh god damn it. It takes so long to convert these provinces. Yay, yeah, cores. Yeah. Fuck how's your war score, Shen? I'm at twenty two on Francie Pants. Okay. What'll it take? Probably 85. Well, if you got my London pretty cheaply. And my truce is up in a year. I it's need 45 war score for Paris. Especially okay. since it did just go up to plus You might be able stability. to get that. Just off of, uh. Um, off of waiting. Fucking hell, they converted. Oh, it. Crimea's trying to help. Help Screw this. Just lose half. land or just stay bad horse work. God, what a pain in the ass that is. I've got a fleet. I want to use it. Crazy, I know, but. More bum, rebels. Bum, Good. Bum, bum, I love rebels. Bum, bum, bum. Portuguese patriots. Finish your siege so I can make you go away. Oh! I just mm. died. And 27 pretender rebels. Oh, only 27? 552 took over. That's not bad. No. Uh, I? I need a general. Come on. Need to do that. You don't need to pause for that shit. Alright. One rebel. New ideas. Denounce the sect practices. Islamic Center of Scholarly Learning. Actually, I guess if as long as Paris falls, we win, so I should just truce break. You know what? Silly. Don't truce break. Yeah. So I it's can go not... after Austria? Well, we're just waiting for. Actually, that's true. If you go after the other stuff. Mm -hmm. Inevitably, uh, that makes France smaller. Yeah. And so Shen will be able to uh, just pick it up. Yeah, I'm just going to get my troops off the coast of France, and I'll go ahead and truce break. The coast of France? What? Or, well, yeah, in Australia. Oh, okay. That mm, coast of France. Just the other France. Kazan, I now have 100% improved relations with you. Now we can be best buds forever. Oh, fuck this Swedish bugs. nationalists. Fuck. It'll be really interesting because they've got almost all of Portuguese Australia right now. Actually, if they end up piecing out and taking that... That'll increase war score. Well, I guess it'll still be Portuguese Australia. Well, no, they'll add it to their territory and then they'll oh, probably yay, form rebels. Uh, French no. Australia. No, they have to core it. Uh, I suppose that's true. Unless they already have French. They have, and they more have rebels. three. And nope. does this island count? Yeah, um, yeah, it's part of the same region. So they actually have four provinces yep. in this colonial nation. Or okay, region. so they just need one more, and the rest of it will get mm -hmm. soaked. Fuck you, rebels! It looks like there's still something else in there that they haven't finished sieging. Siege yeah. that shit. Fuck these rebels right in the ass. Um, Good. Oh my god, and they all have the walls busted. Fuck you rebels with your wall busting fucking wall hacks. And you know, I'm really only declaring war on these guys so they can get closer to... I cannot hear any of you guys over this fucking They're... plumbing. <laughs> and I'm sorry um, to anyone who can hear this plumbing. I can't hear it, actually. So, that's good. Mike's keeping things uh, away from you. And us. Alright, screw it. It's crazy. Let's do it. <gasps> no! So how are you on your ticking war score? Uh, I need like 2% uh, should... more and it's done. Okay. But really, it was kind of unnecessary. <laughs> That's why I said don't do it. 2% more? Oh, I thought you were ages away. 
All right, doesn't matter. Well, every month I get an extra 1%, well, about that, from holding the province that I declared for. And yep. also, every month he loses his resistance because yeah. his capital's taken. Mm -hmm. So it's like a, it's, it's two bonuses working together towards a goal. <laughs> it's beautiful. Your goal? So oh, just to, just to compare, so just to then. just to show how broken the aristocratic idea is, uh, mm -hmm. taking London, a 14 base tax province with dual bonus, important center of trade, plus 10 local trade power, and the Thames Estuary, plus 10 local trade power, only cost me 140 points. In Two comparison, taking Warsaw would cost me 385. It is not mm -hmm. an important center of trade, it is not an estuary, and it's only 11 base tax. Yep. That's incredibly retarded. Yep. That's rough. It is a broken idea group. I wonder if France is going to move its capital to one of the provinces I'm sieging. Maybe. Three war score? I need like one more point. Alright. I'm just happily like invading all of North America. There we go. <laughs> Goodbye, <laughs> Paris. Alright. Boom. 540 to core Paris. So, so hey, Ottomans, you want to buy that? Mode. Oh, you're in a war. Never mind. Yeah, I can't buy it. Everything in Europe belongs to us. Yay! Are you saying that, that we have completed our goal? We I have. think the goal is over. The Sunni strike back. We have struck. It only took 140 episodes. <laughs> or is it 130? It's 130. 130. This, is, this is 133, yeah. Oh my goodness. Well, We're I'm sorry it took mode? this long. My goodness, we are bad at this game. We are terrible at this game. <laughs> There's a really couple little windows. There. But they'll but flip. Oh, it's beautiful. All that green? Oh, it's amazing. Green. Look at that and green. my name is still <laughs> stupid. Look at the green in South America. Oh, God, South America. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm slowly sieging it all out, too. Even Cafe Ottoman is converting. Yep. Well, they have to, because, yeah, it's all... That's what they are. Garbage, but... Well, that's fantastic. The Sunni have <laughs> struck. Look at the Ottomans just marching into Europe. That's insane. Yeah, gargantuan Ottomans, gargantuan Kazan. Yeah, I, I'm I mean, happy I made the full loop. Obviously, there's stuff we could have done better. Like I could have wiped out Oman, and we could have focused on not Europe early. But yeah, means, oh my goodness, they just get bigger. If if we had, I I think you're right. I think you're I think you hit the nail on the head there. If we had gone straight for Africa, uh, Arabia, India, and Asia, like at the start, if we had done that, just gone as much as we could into that we probably would have been so strong we could have conquered europe like a hundred years ago no i don't think it's so. hard to tell no like, no no they would have been more powerful than us. but their power yeah. would have been contained it would have been european power just like it was yeah except then we have other issues like we wouldn't have been able to sneak aragon out as easily um there's all that italy stuff austria yeah. would have got bigger <laughs> france would have got stuff. bigger you got the Teutons, really luckily. I mean, obviously, you joining the coalition against Muscovy really stopped you pretty hard at the beginning. Oh, yeah, that was a bonehead move on my part. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that got you into trouble pretty quick. Um, I wonder but... how long it would take me to annex Aragon. I'm annexing Denmark right now. I'm about halfway done. Well, I guess we're going to have to call it a go. I wonder, you know, if anyone's got any suggestions down below as to what mm -hmm. we should try next. Please yep. leave comments and let us know, and uh, we'll randomly pick something, and if it happens to be the one that you suggested, you'll feel good about yourself. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wheel of morality. Turn, turn, turn. Turn, turn. That's right. <laughs> well, this is a hoot, and uh, praise yep. Allah. Um, yeah, we've got 15 Allahu seconds. Allahu Akbar? 15 seconds left before the beep. Oh, but we've got to hear the robot one last yeah. time here. Yeah, one last time. We actually timed it out so nicely that... We timed it out? Yep, time to do. Doom, 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 doom. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> so that has been us. So thanks, everybody, and uh, see you next time. Adios. Thanks for watching the Sunny Strike Back. And